Okay, today we're going to take a look at a Zeiss Axial Plan 2 imaging microscope, and we've got this set up for DIC. Now this is DIC in the transmitted. It is not DIC in the reflected mode. And what we're going to do is we're going to look at it with a normal analyzer, and then we're going to look at it with the analyzer with the built-in full wavelength, full lambda wavelength plate in it. So right now we've got it set up for a normal analyzer. We have a polarizer in our condenser and we have the DIC set on our Plan NeoFloor 10X objective. So let's take a look at what happens when I rotate the DIC prism. Now this is not a biological specimen, this is a petrographic rock specimen. It's a thin slice of a rock. So it's a little different from what we would normally do with our biological specimens. Now let's go ahead and kick in our full wavelength, full lambda wavelength compensator. Now, as you can see we're, we're getting our colorations. With the rock being a birefringent specimen, we're able to see these color, different color hues. Let's move the specimen around on the slide different areas of the slide give the different color hues. And again, if we take off the full lambda wavelength compensator and we just go to only a straight analyzer, in this case we're still getting some color hues. Okay, here we're back to the full wavelength. You know, this is a straight analyzer. We're getting some color hues, but it's not as intense as with the full wavelength. So this is with the lambda, this is without. So it really depends on where you're at on your specimen. A lot, of, a lot of the specimen does not show any color hues with just a straight pole analyzer, which is what we have right here, a straight analyzer, no compensator. Now, full wavelength compensator. But what we found out is there are areas that will give the color hues no matter what, certain areas. Let's change it to, let's change the magnification. Let's go to a 20 power and take a look at that. Okay, now we've got our full wavelength in place. So that's without the wavelength, full wavelength, and this is with the full wavelength compensator. And let's go to a 40 power. No compensator and with the compensator.
Okay, cut.